Good afternoon, everybody. Nelka here again, and there's another question from our friend Miss Kanit Khon. She said, "I hi. I want to design a room that has mixed lighting, such as downlight fluorescent, but my room requires 300 lumen or 300 lux. Maybe it's 300 lux. So what can I do? Please kindly let me know." Okay, for you, um, can it? I'm not sure if you said 300 lumen or 300 lux, okay? Because lumen is from your luminaire and lux is the lux level requirements for, for some rooms. So I will just assume that you require 300 lux in your room and you want a mix of lighting, all right? So let's go and check this sample project that I have right now in my screen. So let's go and for example, this is the room that I want. So I want to know which one is this room. So yeah, meeting room. Let's go for the meeting room. Check this one and I will select it. Okay, so I selected the meeting room now. And for example, I want to have a 300 lux for this one. So I'll just go to my um, assessment zone tab. Just go here assessment zone tab under your construction tab and then click that one and then edit and say you want to change it into 300 lux okay just edit that one and then for example this one is 200 lux and your calculation surface is 0.8 okay so let's let's just leave it like that and then you just go and select for example you said you want a mixture of lights so i'll go and for example i i have a square down light here so let's go to the 3d so you can see it so i have a square down light here and for example you don't like it let's make a calculation fast and um, you want to mix it with something else like for example let's just imagine this is a fluorescent lamp i will just for example add a suspended luminaire here plus wall mounted here i can also add some cove light if i like to but my ceiling is not uh, good oh okay i can add here so yeah i can mix it up with um say suspended one here at the table and then down lights there and cove lights there and for that and i want to have a 300 lux on this small meeting room okay so let's go now and do it so i'll mix it with um suspended one let's go and check if i have a suspended fitting here um i hope i have one okay i have here so i'll just go and drop it here and then this is, I think, powerful. But this is, let's select another one. Maybe I can have um, lesser, lesser powerful. Okay. Okay, I will just use this one, the punch. And let's see, it's 2 by 28 watt. Okay, it's fluorescent. And let's just remove this one. And then let's put it in the middle. And then let's go and suspend it, say 2.2 meters from the floor, okay? And then now I have um, suspended one and a down light. And if I want to put cove light here, I'll go and select if I have LED strip there. And let's see, so I have flex here, yeah, very good. And I will just run it here. Later I will just adjust, adjust it, okay? So I will just add maybe 10 or 20 pieces of this one. Okay, this is enough, I think. And then on my ceiling, I, I, if I want a cove light, then I need to adjust my ceiling. So I'll go to my ceiling tab. Now it's here. Adjust it. And then I will say offset of 0.1. I can see here if I offset it, there, there will be a ledge here for my LED strip. Okay, so let's... Okay, I will just show it to you in my... Okay, now it's here. So you can see it's here. So I'll just move my LED strip here. And... Okay, now it's confu confusing. Let's go here. And rotate. Like that. 
and then move and up and I want if I want that ceiling to be yeah I think this is close to the ceiling close sides yes good 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 okay so you cannot see it now because uh, I think my assessment zone height is limited to 2.65 so let's go and check my assessment zone yes it's 2.65 and if I want to make it what is my height for the building yeah it's three meter so I'll go and change my assessment zone into three meters so you will see my luminaires when I go to the elevation view. now it's here you can see because uh, if you change your uh, height on your assessment zone anything beyond that you will not see it anymore it will it will also not be calculated anymore this is just another tip and tricks okay so let's go and now i have my um led strip at the same time i suspended and my down lights let's go and check my led let's move it a little close here all right so let's go and run it so i'll go to my this to this set calculation tab and i will select fast because i want to just uh, calculate the room only this room only so let's just uh, let's select this one and let's go to the 3d so we can see it better and then let's run it so if you require 300 locks and if this calculation result shows that it's too much then you either um, reduce the free things either reduce the down lights or uh, select lower lumen output from your range okay it shows that in the meeting room this is 594 and on the table it's 9000 sorry 952 this is too much for a meeting room it is overlit but for example you are using a dali fitting or you have lighting control then it's okay but because you said that you only require 300 lux so you either remove the down lights and just use a suspended one or just select a lower lumen output for lumen output for everything so for example i will now remove this uh, down lights so let's go and delete it and i'll go to the meeting room and recalculate it again and let's see how it goes so but if you want to have down lights still in your room then select a lower lumen output if that uh, downlight has 1000 lumen then select at least 600 lumen or oh okay so you can see this is 267 looks good looks good but because your requirement is 300 lux then it's not enough so we need to but in your table it's okay because it's 500 lux already but because you said 300 lux for overall then i think we need to undo that one and add uh, two down lights two down lights somewhere or let's just select a lower lumen output down light just to supply that missing uh, lux level so for example let's go to tone lighting go to indoor lighting and select the down lights let's just select lower lumen output and for example i will use this situs led and I will say I will just use the 9 watt and because this is an office I will select the 4000 Kelvin okay so I'll just use this one and then say yes and then I'll go and click on the right corner now it will be part of my Dialux uh, Evo and I'll go to the plan view and lay out this down light and for example I want four pieces steel but I want to um, place it a little on the corner. It looks big. Okay, this. What is the diameter? 190. Oh, I don't like this one. Can we select a little smaller, smaller downlight? Let's check, check this one. Okay, I have 150 here. Oh, shoot, but it's 12 watt okay let's just uh, try this one so i will use this um, 4000 kelvin and then i will click it and then it's done there 
and now it's here now in my dialogs so I'll go in apply it here and yes I will put it in the corner so if there are uh, if there is painting on the side it's much better and uh, it's also good for uh, overall uniformity so I just assume it when, when I drag it there but you can uh, check the distance of from that wall okay so let's just check and calculate it and see if we can achieve the 300 lux requirements oh okay it's 557 this is again too much so either you just go and add maybe two down lights in this corner because maybe there are paintings here and leave it open here or nothing because this is a glass area and the light will light from that area will be coming from the side of the reception so it's fine so let's just go and maybe remove these um, two down lights so go and select that one and make it one here oh it's wrong make it one and then this one is one there we go and then just move it here in the corner and then let's run it okay so it's 413 lux it's still too much from your requirement which is 300 lux only so um what is your name again oh, can it this the solution for that is you either um, select a lo lower lumen output down lights again or maybe this one so instead of this is 2 by 28 maybe you can use uh, 1 by 28 only and then for the down light you can select a lower lumen output like for example because this one is 1400 you can go for 900 lumen down light and yeah you can just replace it to achieve your 300 lux level so the secret for a room that has mixed luminaire is by playing with the wattage or the lumen output so even if you have three types of luminaires in your room like for example this one you have strip light you have down lights and you have suspended luminaire even if you have you even if you have three kinds of luminaire you can still achieve your 300 lux requirements by um, selecting luminaires that has lower lumen output output for everything Okay, so I, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and see you again on the next video. Bye!